Alright guys, we are back for another Dokkan Battle video. So we're going to go into one of the hardest fights in the game. Um, we're going up against Red Zone Broly. Now Broly is very, very vicious. Um, he cancels dodge. I mean, I think dodge is the strongest thing you can do. So the reason Broly as a fight can um, put up some resistance is because dodge is a strategy that does not work at all in here, right? But Gohan... Gohan actually does have a key blast nullification. 50% chance for Gohan to just say no when uh, Broly tries to super attack him. So that could be pretty good, right? Being able to just pop a nullification. I would like to try and utilize that in here. Let's see if we'll be able to. You know, my full dodge build's not going to do anything uh, in this Broly fight. I probably wouldn't bring Gohan anyway into this fight. Would I? Um... I mean, I guess with the 50% chance, yeah, because it's like, if you have a 50%, because Gohan's weakness, I guess his weakness is kind of twofold. It's key and defense are, are basically his two areas of concern. Um, if, you know, he's got the 50% chance to just not take damage from Broly, that is essentially a chance to dodge, right? That's what that is. Um, but then he does also have, um, like, his damage is going to be so strong. Like, I, I don't know. Um, all right, I, I want to try and get Gohan's nullification, but we may not be able to, depending upon what the rotation looks like. We'll, we'll see. <音楽><音楽><音楽><音楽> Alright, um, there's not really too much I'm going to try and specifically do here. I, I guess we'll just let, um, God Goku, uh, and then the LR Gods go ahead and cook right here. Um, remember that the LR Gods, they're, they're still just as good as ever. I see... The LR Gods, I would say, is a unit I see so much. Like, I see people overrate this unit to hell, and then I see people underrate this unit to hell. So, it's like, I don't know. Like, the, the Gods, I don't think you could say that they're overrated, underrated, anything. They're still super good. I feel like the 7th Anniversary LR's kits are incredibly strong. Um, the Gods are certainly in a, in a much better spot than um, LR Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. Uh, the reason, of course, is... Teams and you know characters that have come out throughout the year, right? Movie heroes, as we're well aware, has gotten buffed. Oh, I don't know. Every two seconds, movie hero characters have come out. I mean, just look at the last several, like the last half of the year. You get Carnival Goku, LR Goku and Vegeta, right? SCR Piccolo from the Cooler movie. We have Kid Goku, Android Eight, Gamma One, Gamma Two, and then now we have you know Beast Gohan and Orange Piccolo. It's just so much that movie heroes got. Um, that, that's sort of like movie heroes and a lot of these other like sort of like core teams um, These characters have just infected and they're super super good, right? All the characters that have come out sort of post um, Like I, I guess post Tanabata on JB is what I would say because it like I, I, I don't know I, I guess well, I guess pain like I'm not super crazy about pan, but <laughs> All right, so we got Gohan out. Um, kind of an unfortunate... T Look at this bullshit right here, man. Come on. Uh, Broly with a sliver of health. All these characters want to get hit, and they all want to super, and they all want to do all this shit. Um, I guess let's just get Gohan. Gohan is the showcase character. He is the most important. So we'll get him out there in front. Yeah, uh, dude, our team is, is going to be really strong defensively. Having, like, Carnival Goku, Vegeta, and Trunks, God Goku, 
Um, it, it's the only concern here is AOE Broly, right? Like, at, like besides that one phase, just because of how ridiculously cheap it is, we're completely fine. Um, now, remember, Gohan really wants to build up um, by super attacking. Uh, I can't stand how they designed this Gohan to where he builds up only by doing super attacks and not just attacks. Um, I, I've complained about this constantly because all other characters, basically. Um, I brought a Ghost Usher. I don't mind using a Ghost Usher on a rotation that Gohan is not on. So we could do this. Um, if, if I need to use a Ghost Usher um, when we get to AoE Broly, that's, that's fine. I, I don't really mind doing that at all. Because um, this is not, like, I'm not trying to, I've already... Dude, I, I know itemed this fight, I think, at one try when Vegeta and Trunks came out or something like that. So, it's like, it's not like I'm, oh my god, let's go for the no item run. Like, it's, we already got it. Like, it's not a big deal. Um, but I, I just want, when I do these videos, we're specifically looking at the performance of the character, right? So, it's like, I, I don't want to use items at all on rotations that Gohan is on. Um, but I would like to make sure that Gohan's rotation... Um, is going to be very defensive, which is going to be. Because the fact I floated off God Goku right here. So the rotation when we get to AoE Broly should be God Goku, Gohan, um, and then Vegeta and Trunks probably. I mean, there's there's no reason not to have Vegeta and Trunks in slot one on both rotations. Um, and then we can kind of just, you know, have whatever floating characters, you know, that sort of mesh better with Gohan. Um. Okay, so... Not getting Gohan in turn one has definitely hurt us here because <laughs> twice in a row, Vegeta and Trunks and the gods have brought this bully down to a sliver of hell. So we're going to go into this next turn here, right? And like Gohan is going to get one attack off on this bully. So it's like we're going to be towards the end of the fight and Gohan has gotten two attacks, right? I mean, yeah, this is how these can go. That's not good. Well, is it? Gohan is guarding now. Like, if we make it to AoE Broly, we didn't. Gohan would have been guarding. Because Gohan, remember, guards for the first three turns. But I didn't want Kid Goku on rotation against AoE Broly. Yeah, this kind of sucks. Um, we are guarding, though. Remember, we, we link up much better with Kid Goku, but, like, we can't, we can't afford to do that. Um, alright, uh, this has gone pretty bad so far, it's just like, when, when we're using one of these super powered teams now, even, you know, these red zone fights, it just go down like pussies, like, I, you know, people, I feel like would lose their mind if they dropped stages way harder than this, but like, look, look at this, like, it's, we're, like, we, all these characters need, like, like, what hey, we brought Carnival Goku hasn't super attacked yet. Like all these characters need to build up and all this bullshit. Like it's it's just crazy. Let's see let's use uh Ghost Usher here. Now, do I want to Do we do we do we go blue here? Uh, we could. I I think I won't. I won't go blue. And then let's give Carnival Goku a stack right here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're okay with this. We, we can we can greed out an extra stack for the gods, since I'm using the Ghost Usher on this turn anyway. Um, and then if, if AoE Broly is still alive in two turns, which he probably is not going to be, but if he is alive in two turns, um, the gods can finish him with their active skill. Uh, so hopefully Gohan does his beam nullification. If, if he's going to get hit, hopefully he'll do the nullification. Um, cause if not, we will die, but if we do, I'll just cut and we'll come right back to this exact situation. I would like to show it, uh, Gohan having a nullification does matter, by the way. Like, Gohan and Gamma 2 both have beam nullifications. That's good. Um, cause I, you know, they are going to release more bosses at cancel dodge. I mean, I I'm not the only one in the world that thinks that dodge is the strongest mechanic there is. I'm sure the devs, do we do this here? I'm tempted. The reason I could pop Beast right here, and it would be very helpful, actually, is because it'll count as a super attack for us. Which, again, Gohan has done, what, two supers out of the five he needs to build up? Hmm. 
we, uh, thanks to Vegeta, this Vegeta and Trunks have they they just haven't been hit, have they? Yeah, they've they've not gotten hit. So no stack. I think I won't use uh, Beast Gohan here. Oh, that could have gone way better. Oh. Uh... Wow, are you serious? Oh, okay. Hold on. <laughs> that's, uh, that's not gonna fly. What? Okay. God damn it. Um, yeah, we, th th we, we, we've, we've had issues, because Vegeta and Trunks have to get hit, Carnival Goku has to get hit, Carnival Goku wants to super attack, Vegeta and Trunks want to super attack, Beast Gohan wants to super attack, right? Like, we bring this team full of all these characters that are doing this, and then now we are going to run into issues, um... Right, with, with, like, all of these characters being built up and stuff like that. Like, Vegeta and Trunks are still guarding, so we're okay. But them not being built up at all is annoying. How do I... I want to maximize Gohan. Probably this. Let's do that. That's... Okay. Is that... That does get him the additional, though, which is what we wanted. Okay. Yeah, we could do this. I'll, I'll do this. I guess it doesn't matter. I, I was going to do that to give God Goku um, extra defense with all of his orbs, but it doesn't matter because if Gohan doesn't... Like, either we take almost no damage anyway, or Gohan doesn't nullify Broly's AoE and we die. Um, now, we're not super effective against all types with Gohan. It's, it's tough to get 24 key, and Gohan's Link set does suck quite a bit, really, with a lot of... Um, the good characters you're going to be running, like, you know, God Goku in this fight, Vegeta and Trunks, Carnival Goku, right? Like, Gohan's not having links with all these characters. All right, so there, there's the additional right there. Um, that's his guaranteed additional, the 70% chance. That's four supers. All right, so we've supered four times here. No super attack by Broly? Okay. Um, Which, which is fine, because we will just finish uh, Broly off with the God's active skill right here. God Goku getting a lot of additionals. Uh, my God Goku is built full dodge now. This guy additional is a lot. Like, I feel, I feel like I see him do this quite a bit. Super. Okay, dude. Sure. Sure, sure. Um, Let's go ahead and transform with the gods. I think I, w I will play the Gogeta Blue animation, though. Uh, this, this, th this one is just too clean, too raw. We're definitely playing this one. Nice. Even without the 200% leader skill, pretty good damage right there. We got we got that extra stack in last turn, so the extra stacks helped out quite a bit. Uh, damn, dude. Um, sucks. Oh, that's pretty good. Do I? Vegeta and Trunks haven't built it. Let's use Beast Gohan. I'm gonna think about what I want to do here. I think I'm gonna put Gohan in slot one. The problem is that Vegeta and Trunks haven't built. I think I'm gonna put Gohan in slot one. Watch this. It's just uh, the best animation in the game by far. And it's just like, all right, cool. One health bar. Like, okay. Pan does her active skill right here. 75% of Broly's health is gone. Stupid. All right. Um, I'm going to gamble a little bit here. But the reason I'm doing this is because Gohan is the showcase unit. Um, I want to put Gohan in position to get hit right here. Um, This is not going to get us our guarantee. No, it is. One, two, three. Yeah, okay. We, we are going to get the guarantee additional right there. Vegeta and Trunks will live supers 
or excuse me, excuse me. They won't live a super. They'll live normals. W is this a slot seven Vegeta and Trunks? It's not. I, the Vegeta and Trunks that was in slot seven, I think one of them was, would still have their guard up, even not in slot one. Let's see. So Beast Gohan broke that, so we don't have to worry about that. Now he super attacks. He's now fully built up as well. Um, I I'll be very curious to see either he nullifies the, the super attack by Broly, or he goes out like a pussy, probably. We didn't get the additional super. We did get the hidden potential system additional, though. That's good. That's good. Remember, this, this gets him an extra, what, 30% defense? Okay. Nice. Fuck out of here, Broly. Beautiful. Beautiful. Um, now, we're good. That That's not quick enough. Uh, he, Broly's not super attacking in slot two. So Vegeta and Trunks are going to be safe. They might take a little bit of damage here, but they're not built up. They haven't really gotten stacks in or anything like that. They're not going to get the extra 70% from being in slot one either. They might take a little bit of damage here. Yeah, just a little bit of damage. Um, but that that was that's intentional. I wanted again, I wanted to put Gohan in position to show what he can do against Broly. So that's fine. That's fine. And that that's I mean that's what Vegeta and Trunks can look like when again they've not been hit to build up. They have not uh, stacked. You get a super right here. Carnival Goku could have taken it. Oh, can we do the Father Son Galcon? Oh hell yeah, brother! You already know. Alright, so... Are we, are, is this done? I think we're done here, huh? I think so. Alright, just give me the most key and stuff like that. Bam, and then bam. I th yeah, I think that's, that's probably GG. I don't think Broly's gonna live through this turn. Okay. Um, I mean, that was good. We, we saw what Gohan can do. Um, we used Beast Gohan. We broke Broly's attack, and then we're able to put Gohan right in front of Broly's super attack and then nullify it, right? Um, attack breaking on the Beast Gohan active skill is pretty good. Um, regardless of how much key he gets right there, I think I, I, I wasn't thinking correctly last turn. No matter what, right, how much key he's at. Um, on the turn where he does his active skill, he will still get the super effect against all types, and he will get the guaranteed additional no matter what. I mean, Gohan is definitely good. Haha, <laughs> Vegeta and Trunks, sure, dude. <laughs> um, Gohan is definitely good. Definitely, he's really good. But, like, how good is really, really good? I just, like, do I think Gohan is better than Golden Frieza? And, like, Carnival Goku. Like, like the STR... Because Car Carnival, STR Goku, and Golden Frieza, they pretty much are very similar um, in, like, damage, defense, and stuff like that. You could do a lot. Um, Carnival Goku, of course, has the support over Frieza. I'm surprised Broly lived. Damn, I wish I had the Beast Gohan active. Well, I guess we could finish with Kid Goku. Go Gohan Goku? We could. Um, now, we could... What what is this 450 454 is it? We're on a 200%. That's with all in the family too. Um I could win duh with either Kid Goku or Vegeta and Trunks, right? Like we see this. But what we're going to do is I want Gohan to get more screen time here. So, let's see. Double digits before he supers is good and he's at 13 million right there. I just, I don't know. I, he is just an issue. Like, there's issues for Gohan, man. Like, he is very good. He He's definitely, like, he's certainly better than Goku and Vegeta and Metal Cooler. Oh, yeah. I, I Like, I, I think I'm taking Gohan over Metal Cooler for sure. It's like once we get to like, you know, 7th Anniversary LRs, um, Golden Frieza, Carnival STR Goku, Gohan certainly feels more in line with those characters. Um, 
than, say, along with, like, cooler Vegeta and Trunks Carnival Goku level. Um, Gohan is very good, but he's not quite at the highest tip, I would say. Let me know what you guys think of our, our boy Gohan. I mean, he certainly did very well in this video, right? Um, thanks guys for watching. I'll catch y'all next time.